Our next speaker will uh, speak out about uh, Debian uh, adaptation um, to uh, use OS for uh, two years old uh, kids. Uh, this is uh, Jean-Michel Philippe for Doodoo Linux. Let's applause him. Hello. Um, so today um, I'd like to show you uh, Doodle Linux. Uh, uh, I'd like to show how, how it looks like and how it works. But uh, first of all, uh, I will tell some words about uh, the project itself to let you know uh, what we are doing and why we are doing uh, Doodle Linux. Uh, so, uh, Doodle Linux uh, is a full computer system based on Debian. Uh, the objective is to maximize uh, the ease of use. Uh, and to uh, provide children with uh, tools that are uh, self-fulfilling. Uh, basically, this is a live CD, so uh, it, it is autonomous. Uh, it takes care of uh, uh, protecting, preserving uh, data that may be on the computer already. It is designed by parents, and um, uh, the project now is uh, three years old, more, ma ma more than three years old. And we, we have um, seen more than uh, 400,000 uh, visitors, and we have more than uh, 40 uh, language teams. So, um, today, uh, technology for small children um, is coming, and uh, it takes the form of uh, gaming consoles, of course, uh, tablets, uh, TV. There are TV channels that are said to be for uh, children from one or two years old. And uh, the common uh, thing between all these devices is that they are not designed uh, to, uh, to promote uh, self-fulfilling of children, but rather to be addictive. Uh, for example, there are uh, software, um, game, game software uh, editors uh, that hire neuropsychiatrists to, uh, to make games more addictive. Uh, also, um, there is also, also a provision of digital entertainment, so that finally children end um, um, doing passive activities. They are in front of screens and don't do so many things by themselves. Um, the problem is that uh, as children will build our future, if they like too much this kind of technology, uh, which is uh, above all, um, um, spying uh, and uh, kind of malware technology, uh, our future will be built on the uh, tools that our children like now. The objectives uh, of Doodle Linux, of course, is uh, ease of use, robustness, and uh, something that is as close as possible uh, to uh, the use of uh, gaming consoles. Uh, we want to stimulate the potential of if each children, each child. We want to favor autonomy and self-confidence. Uh, we, we don't want that children um, have the impression that uh, computers are complicated uh, and uh, too much complicated compared to uh, consoles and uh, tablets. Uh, we also want them to master technology because uh, we live in a world in which uh, technology is uh, controlling almost everything. And uh, if uh, in the future our children are not able to master technology, they won't be able to uh, master their own uh, future. Uh, and of course we want to be uh, safe and secure for the parents uh, to be uh, 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 quiet uh, with uh, children on their computers. Uh, so right now we have achieved uh, quite a, a good work, but we still have lots of um, ideas to develop. Uh, if you want to help uh, us develop, of course, uh, no problem, you are welcome. Uh, so we want to provide more uh, activities uh, for uh, creation. Uh, we want to provide more digital contents because this is um, uh, an important use of computers today. Uh, actually, we, we want to show children uh, everything that is possible to do with a computer. So, uh, of course, there is internet, of course, there is games, but there is also digital contents and uh, crea creative activities. Uh, we would like to develop cooperation uh, between uh, children. 
uh, we would like to develop activities that uh, allow children to use computers as a tool in, the, in real life, uh, for example with their, their toys, and why not develop the communities of children uh, to share their experiences. So uh, as I told you, uh, you can help us uh, and uh, there are lots of things that any, anyone can do to, to help do the Linux. Uh, you have an exhaustive list uh, here and uh, if you don't have time to, uh, to spend and to offer to our project, you can still help by donation uh, and, and goodies and buying goodies. So now um, let's look at uh, the Linux itself. Uh, when you start the Linux, uh, oh, I'm sorry, this is the French version. Uh, you uh, you will uh, find a, a menu, a main menu that is this menu. Uh, <coughs> it is organized uh, by difficulty. Uh, for the smallest children from uh, around one, one year or two years old, uh, they see their parents on the computer uh, using the mouse and using the keyboard, so they want to take the place of the parents, and uh, usually they, they do like this with the mouse, and they do like this with the, computer, uh, with the keyboard. Uh, and uh, most uh, often uh, parents are running uh, Windows or something like that, and uh, they immediately tell their children, no, don't do this. Uh, you are going to break something, and of course this is not the best way to be confident with computers. Uh, so, um, to address this issue in uh, Doodle Linux, we propose uh, um, uh, a kind of learning path, uh, starting with Gamin. So when the children are really young, they can learn the mouse and learn the keyboard uh, with this application, which, well, yes, uh, now it works. So when you move uh, the cursor of the mouse, uh, you just have a, a nice uh, draw. When you click, uh, you have the shapes that are displayed. Uh, if you press on the keyboard keys, but, well, you just have the sign which is on the key uh, shown on, on, on the display. <coughs> and usually after one or two weeks, the children uh, understand uh, how it works and you can uh, lead them to uh, something more complicated. Uh, yes, it's a bit slow. Uh, so, uh, next activity uh, is uh, uh, around um, the mouse, mastering the mouse. Uh, this is indeed a, a set of activities. And, um, uh, for example, here you are uh, taught to, uh, uh, to make a drag and drop. Mm, uh, of course, uh, <laughs> I always fail when I, when I want to show. Uh, no. So it's quite simple, and uh, when the children are quite small, uh, this is really uh, adapted. And uh, fitting one. Where is my cursor? Yes. So, in uh, PySecash, uh, you can learn uh, drag and drop. You can learn to press the right and the left buttons. You can learn to make a double click. And then uh, you have, um, you, can, you can try uh, with your children Shy Play, which is another uh, suite of, uh, of game, of educational games. Uh, for example, you can uh, learn the, the keyboard in this game. So you have, um, here are the figures uh, falling down and you have to press the correct key to make the, the, the figure disappear. And uh, if you don't press the correct one, this doesn't do anything. So uh, the children uh, continue to, to learn uh, the computer 
uh, here you, you can use a text paint and then uh, a smaller a small version of jcompre we have removed uh, the most complicated activities of jcompre uh, in this one and finally you end with uh, environments that are uh, more similar to what is usually uh, uh, found on computers mini Dudu linux is a restricted version of two Dudu linux in english this is all Dudu linux so you find uh, again the, the some of the applications that were available before plus additional uh, applications for example uh, this small cat this is a, a nice game with a cat uh, you have to uh, uh, select the correct uh, uh, stuff to avoid that the, the, the cat get uh, wet because a uh, cat doesn't doesn't like to be don't like to be wet so uh, for, for this one you have uh, to use the tap to block uh, the rain and so So in this environment, the child is supposed to use only uh, uh, one tab with application launchers and this tab is only uh, for settings like the speed of the mouse. So instead of uh, offering uh, strange parameters like acceleration and speed for uh, mouse, we just propose, we just offer to, to set the normal uh, or uh, <coughs> A slow uh, mouse, for example. So, uh, Dudu Linux is simple for uh, children, but also for parents, as you can see. Finally, um, the most advanced activity uh, lets children uh, access all the applications installed in Dudu Linux. So, we uh, Again, we have uh, the educational uh, tab with uh, the former applications. We have uh, new tabs. The first one is work. And uh, we will find a calculator, a text editor. Where is the text editor? Here. Uh, here we have two applications to learn programming. In the first one, you have to, uh, to draw something on the screen uh, uh, giving uh, all commands to a turtle. In this one, you have to make an ant uh, get out of a labyrinth, still with commands. We have put in work uh, some uh, additional uh, drawing uh, applications. My paint uh, to, to uh, draw with uh, tools that look like real tools. Uh, TBO uh, is um, a comic editor so you, you can draw frames and then uh, edit a frame uh, and put uh, uh, characters in frames for example no? So you can also access the internet. Unlike most of Linux uh, distributions, we have uh, chosen to not show the Google search page as a default, but rather to uh, propose children to visit websites whose philosophy is quite similar to uh, free software's philosophy. So uh, uh, you have a wiki, uh, the series of wiki uh, Sites, for example, you have OpenStreetMap, OpenFreePath Library to get uh, draws. <coughs> there are filters, uh, content filters inside the Linux. This is not a server on the internet that would uh, know everything that people do on their computer. Everything is local. Uh, web pages are filtered on their contents, uh, ads are removed, and we also have uh, added uh, a filter for uh, JavaScript. Uh, code 
but uh, send uh, personal information on servers. We have many games, uh, maybe 30 games. We try to select uh, games that uh, requires to think or to uh, elaborate strategies. Yeah, we are running out of time, so if maybe there is some question. Okay. Let's be quick. Uh, just one question. It's uh, about uh, the selection of the package and software that you are installing in, uh, within the, uh, of, uh, with the operating system. Uh, would it be uh, of, uh, about how you make your selection for this software? We, we try to select children uh, um, applications that are simple enough for children. Uh, and then for parents too. We also um, want uh, to show everything that is possible to do with computers. So um, we want to extend the panel of applications with time in order to include activities that are not yet in the Linux. Uh, most of the time, we are using software that is already in Debian to lower the development effort. But it may happen that we need to uh, package uh, some uh, extra software. Um, I would like to know if it is intended to, uh, to have Dudu Linux uh, running under some tabs, tablets, because it could be really cool also. Yes, uh, currently the stable version of Dodo Linux is still based on uh, Debian Squeeze, but we have started to port to uh, Debian Wheezy, and uh, since December our uh, package reposit repository has uh, um, ARMHF uh, packages and uh, also Raspbian packages. Uh, so um, Dodo Linux is partly running on, uh, on ARM and uh, with the uh, fastest uh, port. Uh, of ARM. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have tablets for testing purposes, so if you know uh, people who uh, would agree to uh, give uh, tablets to our project, uh, you are welcome. So, uh, how well is the language support for different languages? Uh, it is very variable. Uh, there we have uh, maybe four or five languages for which uh, the translations are fully completed. Uh, and uh, around 15 or 20 languages that are between 90 and uh, 100 percent. Uh, this depends a lot on uh, translator availability, of course, and uh, usually they don't work on the long time, on the long term. Uh, on our project. Thank you for your talk. You're welcome. <laughs>